Hello everyone, welcome back and today ERC is here on mobile. As you can see here, we are now able to play Liberty County on a mobile device. So I guess let's hop right into this and go ahead and get started with our first game on ERC Mobile. Now loading in, it actually does load very fast, which I was very impressed by. Uh, considering the size of the map and how many assets are in the game, it's it's managed to load really well. And uh, you can see here already, we've got our basic UIs. So the left uh, is of course the toggle to move uh, around the place and look and stuff. You can use your right finger or your right hand, I guess, to look around and whatnot. Uh, then you've got sprint, you've got jump and that sort of stuff. Now, in the top right, you can see the UI. Uh, so if you click on that, you can actually bring up the servers and everything. And if we go into the server list, we can see that there's actually mobile only servers. So essentially only mobile players can go into there and they can have some fun. So I think what we'll do is we'll hop into one of those servers just so we're surrounded by mobile players as well with us. Now, here we are inside of the map and honestly the game looks great on mobile in my opinion the only problem is in the top right as you can see this ui overlays or that roblox kind of uh, three dots overlays the cash ui i believe that is but apart from that i think the ui's look great uh, scaled on mobile and i haven't even got one of the newest uh, phones out there and it runs really well to be fair. Now you can only fit three things in your inventory but that's more of a Roblox thing because that's how many things you can fit in your inventory. Hello people. So what we're going to do we're going to go over here and we'll spawn in ourselves a car. So uh, let's come over here we're going to spawn in. There we go. Spawn in ourselves a car. So we got ourselves a car. It is smoking because I've used this car before but uh, let's head on our way here. Now steering is relatively easy. I think this is actually better than the uh, old iPad and tablet steering. Having the left and right uh, kind of button to move. We're going to head over to the mod shop here real quick to fix uh, my car there. There we go. Go ahead and fix it. And we can always change the color. Uh, we'll leave the color as it is, to be fair. Don't want to waste too much money. So yeah, I'll do a full tutorial on, on kind of a beginner's guide to Imagine Response Liberty County soon enough. But as you can see for the moment here, uh, we're just going to drive around the city a bit as we explain some things. In the top right, we've got uh, starting from the left going to the right, we've got our map here. Ooh, there we go. It takes a bit of getting used to after playing on PC for like three years. But you can see the map, you can kind of scroll in and out here. It works it's really efficiently. You've got the different toggles down here so you can see the building numbers, bus stops, that sort of stuff. So really handy information to help you get around the map. Um, and then over here we've got next up is the mafias. So you can create a mafia which helps you rob a bank and whatnot. Um, then we've got the server list. Oh no, sorry. That uh, bit over there is the server information. Next up, we've got the animations, uh, so I can't do them because I'm in a car. And then we've got the settings, so you can enter promo codes. It's actually a new promo code, so if you are playing uh, at the time of release, there is a new promo code, mobile, all capitals. And you can go ahead and change kind of your spawning locations, background music, etc, etc. And as you can see from playing, the game actually loads relatively well. I think because I was just driving in a circle, it hasn't loaded the rest. But as you can see, the map loads... Oh, oh gosh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, officer. I'm sorry. Okay, that uh, officer's not having a great day over that. But... Uh, for playing on a mobile device that hasn't got the best processor in the world, this actually loads relatively well. And from testing, my phone battery only seemed to go down only a couple of percent uh, after playing the game for even 20-30 minutes. So I think uh, performance-wise, the developers have done an amazing job. I'm running 60 FPS, not great internet or a top-end phone. So you can see here it's performing really well. And even if we go kind of into a, a burning fire, which is probably not the best of ideas, but for uh, entertainment's sake, I guess you could say here. Um, there you go. So we've got some burning fires over here. And you can see my game performs really well. So now, as I said before, there are mobile only servers. So as you can see, this is a server full of simply mobile players. So I guess shout out to everyone in the server at the moment for playing on mobile, testing it out. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry. I'm not wanted. Don't worry. You don't have to worry about me. Anyways, hopping back into our vehicle. Uh, I think they're just we're going to whip out their sniper again. We're going to drive away before we accidentally get shot at. I really do like driving with this, to be fair. I think the driving with the left and right arrow buttons is a lot easier, in my opinion. Possibly because I play on keyboard. It's kind of similar to how a keyboard works, I guess. We're pressing the uh, A and D keys to turn left and right. But there you go. As you can see, we're thundering down the road now in the paid access vehicle here. 
Now, as on PC or tablet or whatever the device you're playing on, all of the jobs are, are fully functional on mobile. So you can become a firefighter, you can become a police officer, you can work at the Department of Transportation. As you can see, we'll go ahead and spawn in a fire engine there. And we've, all, we've still got all these same kind of functionalities. So we can get an attack line, which we can use to fight fires with, as you can see here, and uh, use the nozzle there to spray. So there you go, we can kind of spray around the area. Beautiful stuff. There we go, let's go and detach the um, attack line, but we can get a supply intake, so we can go and grab that uh, 50 feet, let's say, and we can go and plug that in to a fire hydrant over there. I think that's a bit too short, actually. Oh, there's a burning car over there. Let's see if we can actually go ahead and put out our first fire on mobile. Let's see if that works. Oh, we've also got uh, the officer, so we can probably go and help them after as well. Right, we'll go ahead and get an attack line here. We'll just go 100 feet, so we have a bit of mobility. And here we go. Let's just keep spraying, but there we go. We've got our XP, we put out the fire, and beautiful stuff. I think it actually despawned, but there you go. You can see it does work, and it actually works really well, to be fair. It's really easy to control, really easy to move around and uh, utilize all the tools. Again, if you go into the compartment, we've got all the tools in here. So you can see here we've got a bunch of different tools. Um, we've got the uniforms, etc., etc. Everything you would have on PC. Same thing on law enforcement. Uh, let's see, we can actually check the player list in the top right. There is one criminal there. Uh, I think there's another one. All right, we've got one criminal in this server, so I guess we can go ahead and load on our uniform there. We'll go ahead and get ourselves, we actually do have a gun already, and uh, we should have a taser, so we can go and spawn in our unit and get moving. Here we go, we're actually low on gas in this car, so I'm not sure how far we're going to be able to go, but uh, we can press this kind of uh, siren button and we can turn on our ELS. Um, it's kind of hard to see on this vehicle, there you go, you can kind of see it. Um, there you go. Yeah, it's hard to see because I don't have a light bar and this is an undercover package. But um, yeah, it does show you, you can edit all of your vehicle customization like on PC, um, on mobile and tablet, which is very nice and uh, good to see for all of those mobile players. And we've got all the buttons. I think the only thing we don't have is the uh, warning lights, but we have got functioning indicators, horn, etc, etc. Okay, we just had a collision there. Let's just get out here, make sure everyone's okay. That car just drove off. Let's actually move our car out of the way because we're currently blocking the road. So if we move in here, it looks like DOT have uh, put some cones down. There we go, perfect, right. So DOT have put some cones down. Um, oh gosh. Uh, I think it's a bit of server lag. Okay, there we go. Yeah, overall, I really do enjoy playing on mobile. It reminds me of the days back in 2018, 2019, where I did used to play uh, games like Mad City and Jailbreak on mobile. But yeah, I, I really do like playing on mobile. Honestly, it's really handy. You can play anywhere. Uh, once you've got a mobile device on you. Hello there. Um, oh, oh gosh. Oh gosh. Okay, I do not have good reaction times. All right, inside of our vehicle we go. Who was shooting at us? I think it was the uh, person in the yellow car, wasn't it? All right, I haven't really tested shooting on mobile. Yeah, no, that didn't work. Okay, well, we'll wait here for a medic to come and, uh, well, help me. There we go. We'll go and call a medic. But, um, yeah, you can see, I think it's really fun, honestly, on mobile. It is hard to do things like type, so it's going to be a bit hard for mobile players to do kind of serious role plays and whatnot. Um, but I definitely think it's a really fun experience if you want to just hop in the server with your friends and, um, you know, do some chases and whatnot. I think it's fun on that end. So thank you very much for watching this video. Hope you did enjoy. I'll do full tutorials on my channel soon. Basically, how to everything in EOC really. Basically just giving you a full guide around the game um, and making sure that new players know exactly what to do and how to do things. Making sure you have the best experience possible. So anyways, have a great day. Hope you enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more videos like this in the future and stay up to date with our very exciting role plays coming soon. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.